Well, returning to work after having a baby is a reality that many parents face, but parting ways with your newborn may not come very easy to some. Melissa Fry is live in the studio with a look at parents' options for infant care. Melissa? Yeah, Dan Gio, it didn't take uh, much searching to realize that there's not really a lot out there for daycare for infants. We did, however, find two local businesses that do provide a care for infants, but in very different ways. It's just another day in the office for Justin Bruce and his son Callan. Callan is just five months old and thanks to the Pacific Cascades Babies in the Workplace program, he gets to spend the day with his dad. Um, but I was excited when we found out we were pregnant that I'd be able to bring him with me to work. So It's one of the more unique workplaces you'll ever come across. A credit union that allows newborns to come to work with their parents. <laughs> Justin says with him and his wife both working full time, child care was a necessity. This program has not only taken care of that, but has also allowed the two of them to spend quality time together. Not her going to work, not having the pay for the summer, and then having to try to figure out child care when she goes back to work, uh, not having that burden is, is a blessing. It's really helped me and him to, to have that bond and continue to foster that relationship, um, you know, not having dad away for the entire day and then only having a couple hours before he goes to bed at night. Bruce and the rest of his staff can thank Pacific Cascades CEO Bob Harris for the policy. He stole the idea from a California credit union after reading about it in a newsletter. And I'm a parent of three now growing kids, but I know how important child care is and we thought it was a wonderful way to have a win-win and everybody gets to benefit, including the, the newborn. The program allows parents to bring in their baby until they reach eight months or start to crawl. Bob says while it doesn't work for all babies, most enjoy their days on the job. They all have their moments, but uh, it, it for the most part it works out very well. Justin and Callan work behind the scenes, but a teller out front is just days away from meeting his son. It's Kalai Kupa'apono. Akihiko Gonzalez is his full name. Mike Gonzalez could hardly believe that a program like this existed. And they were like, yeah, you can bring your baby to work here. It's like, really? Is that, is that real? In addition to getting to spend time with Kalai every day, Mike is just as thankful to have a huge financial burden lifted. Uh, it's $8,000 savings, really, just by you know, Pacific Cascade letting us have him here. And that's pretty incredible. <laughs> Now, if you're not a Pacific Cascades employee and you're looking for infant care, there are options out there, but they may be hard to track down and will likely take a large chunk of change. It is so expensive for child care and to have a good quality, loving environment, it's very hard to find. And, you know, for working families, basically they're working just to pay for child care. Paula Sheridan is the director of the Kids Christian Learning Center in Eugene. They are one of the few places in town that will accept infants as early as six weeks. She says if you're looking for child care for an infant, start early. We have a waiting list a lot of times. Uh, we do have one going all the time, sometimes three, four months out. We have parents that will call up that's due three months from now and they'll want to get on that list and pay a deposit to be able to assure the spot. And the folks at Kids understand how difficult it is on parents who must return to work. So they do their best to keep costs down and stay flexible. Now, if you're a parent looking for child care or you know someone who is, I put up a list of some of the options here in Western Oregon up on KEZI.com. Just click on the Features tab where you'll find Baby on Board. And if you happen to know some ideas here around town, we'd love to share with them with the community. Uh, you can also add those to KEZI.com. Dan, Gia, back to you. Well, thanks, Melissa. She's getting close to herself. I know. Well,